Hey, it's me, Jim Cunningham, and Woodrow the Wonder Dog. Summer in Minnesota. Woody and I dug up a place for your kids and your dog this summer, courtesy of the Canine Coach. It's dog camp for kids. The Canine Coach is an award-winning dog training center that has grown to four locations in the Minneapolis-St. Paul area. It's where Woody and I have done all our obedience training. Maureen Haggerty is the owner and head trainer. It started as a career change. I was in the corporate world and wanted to do something with dogs. So I looked at doing um, bomb and drug detection right after 9-11 and couldn't get that off the ground. And then, but in the course of that, I got really well-trained dogs, training them to do this ex activity and got known as a dog trainer and then start helping out with some classes. And I just put my own spin on the classes that people seem to really like and it took off. So Maureen, you're training dogs, you're winning awards, but how did the idea for a dog camp for kids come about? I was talking to a friend and he was talking about summer camp season for kids and so forth. And then I owned an outdoor park and I'm like, gosh, it's being underutilized. Hang on, what do you heard the word park? You want a what? We call it our park. It's a one acre fenced in field with a pavilion building. It's fenced in, um, got all the sort of kid equipment, it's all dog equipment, you know, agility and so forth. And we do classes that are outdoors and people can rent it just to let their dogs play in a fenced in area. Anyway, so we thought, hey, let's get kids and dogs together one week. So as the idea started to take shape, Maureen knew just who to call to bring the kid component to dog camp. I think it was kind of the perfect blend. Of course, Maureen brings a lot of dog experience and dog training experience to the table. And I started in early childhood about 32 years ago. And I'm a licensed pre-kindergarten teacher and a licensed parent educator, a master's degree in family education and a PhD in work community and family education. And I think for me, it was more around the educational component, really wanted to tap into what would be educationally um, appropriate and interesting and fun for children at the same time, giving them an awesome camp experience. And we cover uh, four segments, learning about dogs, obedience, dog sports, and crafts. I remember we learned about like what you should and shouldn't do when you like see a dog or meet a dog for the first time, or just like having your dog interact with other dogs. It's not a camp to get your dog trained. So you're definitely not sending your dog to get trained. You're sending your child to camp to give them a better experience with their dog. Uh, many kids love dogs and they love, they hug and they kiss and they glom on. Dogs don't like that. Yeah. So it's about teaching them how to be with your dog and foster a better relationship. And a lot of the dogs already knew stuff, but they won't listen to a child. Right. So how do you help the child present themselves so the dog will listen to the kid? The relationship is what's being fostered. And if you're a kid who doesn't have a dog, Dog Camp for Kids may be able to provide you with a loner, like reggae. We don't have a dog since my dad's allergic, but I, I like dogs, so I just came to this camp so I could be with dogs. And and reggae was uh, was your guy at yeah. camp, and see, he still looks like he is completely comfortable with you there. And then I made him this. Did thing. you make this that? Reggae, yeah. yeah. I heard about this camp, and I thought this was wonderful. What a great way for her to have a chance to be with a dog, more than just taking a neighbor's dog for a walk, and to learn how to do dog care so that perhaps she could be the dog sitter in the neighborhood or the dog walker or have opportunities to be with the dogs when she couldn't have it as a pet. One of Claire's friends' uh, moms emailed me to say, I found this kid in dog camp and let's sign the girls up. And so I signed Claire up even though her friend couldn't go. And she had a great time. I think she and Eddie both just were happy to go and were in a fantastic mood when I picked them up and had fun with the um, craft projects they did. And she loved getting to meet other dogs and other kids. And the girl who was helping her out was wonderful and did an incredible job. All right, good job, good call, Claire. You know Eddie really well. Well, truth be told, I'm not a kid anymore, but I'm about to play one on TV because doggone it, Woody and I wanted to go to dog camp together. So okay, I'm gonna give them to you. Go on the other side. And I go over get here. On your hands and knees, hands get and your knees. face in that tunnel. Hey, buddy. And look stick at this. your treat hand through there. Now you gotta really get in it. All you right. want him in it. I'm going in the tunnel. I've got a treat. Woody, I'm in the tunnel. You can get in the tunnel. My fear is I'm not going to be able to get out of the tunnel when Woody gets in the tunnel. 
Okay, I think Woody's ready. Should okay, we send buddy, him in? Okay, buddy, come on in then. Okay. This tunnel's not big okay, enough for the both of us. Okay, back up, Jim! Back up, Jim! You can do it! <laughs> Look at there! That's, I'm so proud so, of you. So did now it. that was it. easy. It that went really from was. like scared yes. to simple. Yeah. So a basic tr concept in dog training is to break it down where the dog can only but be successful. And then we build on successes. So now that was easy of course, schmeasy. Of course. Right? He's that like, makes well, sense. that was yes, easy. Yes, yeah, so now, now we increase it, but at a point that he doesn't even notice. Right. So are we going to do this? Okay. And then we'll probably be able to double it. All right, pal. Look, I'm there in. he comes. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. Good job! I almost got him. I almost got him. So this is part of the kids' camp. This is fantastic agility training. Yes. Okay. You want to make it a little more difficult okay. now. A little more difficult. But let's keep your head down there again. Okay. Yeah, okay. yeah. Okay, here he comes. Woody. Come Whee! on, buddy. Yes. I didn't have to go in the tunnel yeah. at all. Three tries. He's so tunneling. Let's, let's build on successes. That's my boy. That's my boy. He's a superstar. He is. And he's very excited right now. Ready, 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 ready. Okay, let's go. Ready, there he goes. Come on, buddy. Yeah. Come on, buddy. Yeah. Sure. No treat even this time. You just did it for the fun and, of it. Exactly. That's my then boy. they start learning it's fun and they just want to do it. Yeah. I want to do it. Oh, That's you should. The, yeah. <laughs> That's my boy. Good job. Good job. So oh, hold oh, his, oh. Put his head down. We'll see if he comes to me. Okay. Let's go in there. Buddy. Buddy. Come on, buddy. He's getting the treats. Come on, buddy. Yeah. Yay! Look at that! Okay, Roll. buddy, go! Come on, bud! Come on, buddy! That's a boy! Yeah. <laughs> Look at you! Now, at now all on, I want to do is go in the tunnel. Woody! Come on, Woody! Ready? Woody, go! Come on, bud! Come on, buddy! Come on! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Good job! Good job! That's a boy! Oh, adults and kids alike. That's Love terrific! It. Hey, if you want to send your kid and dog to camp together this summer, visit thecaninecoach.com. Dog camp for kids. It's a win-win with the canine coach. Where are we going? I'll go with you. Where, wherever we're going, I'll go. Life to the Max is brought to you by LifeTouch. Photography for a lifetime.